Okay, full name, including any dodgy middle names. No dodgy middle names, just Stuart Rustling. Okay, Stewie, your age and don't lie. I'm 54. Your position in the company? Um, I was just like a Beachwood Bates tester, but now I've been given the youth coordinator title to help bring the youth through into the um, Beachwood lot. Ooh, get you. Hmm? You've got a title now. <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> so, length of time at Beachwood Bates? Um, probably a bit about eight, nine months now. Okay, cool. Married or single? Married. Happily or not? No, happily married. She helps me out with me fishing, so I'm happily. Cool. So, how long would you say your missus has been the boss in your house? Um, the best part of 30 years. <laughs> what would your missus say is your worst habit? Um, non-stop talking about fishing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it is. <laughs> <laughs> okay, cool. Do you have a goal for your angling this year? Yeah, I just want to improve on what we've done and, and help Beachwood go into different things. We've done a great time at Larford. Um, I'd like to crack over the £20 at Larford this year. Cool, okay. If you didn't fish, what do you think you'd do instead? Um, mountain biking, cycling. Okay. Your biggest fish you've caught so far in life? Um. It'd probably be a sea fish, a shark. Um, that was just over hundred pound. Wow, where was that? Um, that was just off um, Lou in Cornwall. Fantastic! I didn't know that. Mm. I don't know something new. What's your most embarrassing fish fishing mishap? Um, probably fishing at a place called Wayside uh, with my friend, and I based myself on a bit of a slope, and my arms went off. Jumped out and I rolled down the hill nearly into the lake. That was probably <laughs> my worst one. <laughs> Your best fishing session of 2016? Um, I could say laugh. We had uh, some cracking days on laugh, but me and Brian have had a, a couple of cracking days at uh, Flushing Meadows and Rosemary. Okay. What's your go to bait? Um, it probably would have to be Trigonella. I love my trigonella. That's a good choice, mate. What's your most treasured piece of kit? And don't say the rod that's in my kit. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't seen that rod for a while. Um, probably my carp rods. Your carp. Okay, yeah. cool. Uh, popcorn or crisps? Crisps. One more drink with the lads or make sure you're home on time. Which one is it? I probably have to be home on time. <laughs> oh, you <laughs> let me down there. <laughs> Most underrated method of catching carp, in your opinion? Um, just simple call uh, to go to. You know, everybody tries all these fancy tricks and rigs and carp love a bit of yellow corn. Cool. What's your desert island tune? You can only pick one. Uh, it'd have to be a David Bowie song. Um, Gene Genie. Okay. What's your favourite venue of 2016? Um have to be Lloyd's Meadow. I think you can go there, have pleasant surroundings, great fishing, uh, and get looked after. I think it's a great place. And what's your go-to brand of tackle? Um, probably um, Dyer. Final question. So it wasn't too painful. Was no, it wasn't too bad. So, what message would you like to give our social media followers? Um, join in, get into the fishing. You know, it's a great insight to everybody. It's a great relaxing sport. Um, and the team, they've got a wealth of knowledge, whether it be from river fishing, carp fishing, match fishing, there's a bit for everybody to get into. And we can all help each other. Thanks, Stewie Russell. Thanks a lot, buddy.